The St. Francis Red Flash football team concluded the 2009 season this past Saturday against the Central Connecticut State Blue Devils, but began the day with a pregame Senior Day ceremony honoring the team's upperclassmen. Cornerback Josh Bentley, defensive lineman Russell Fisher, offensive lineman Kevin Hernandez, linebacker and special teams ace Chad Iacchini, center Cody Kakipi, tight end Matt Martella, safety Siafa Lavala, cornerback Terrence Long, running back Calvin Williams, and wide receiver Antoine Rivera were all honored in the pregame ceremony. We thank them for their service to St. Francis University and wish them the best of luck in the future. Now it would come down to the last game of the season, the Blue Devils trying to clinch the Northeast Conference crown, the Red Flash trying to play spoiler. First drive of the game, the seniors playing with some emotion. Check out Siafa Lavala here coming out on the option and taking out running back James Mallory of the Central Connecticut State Blue Devils. On that same drive, Norris rolls out to his right. Aubrey Norris gets picked off near the end zone. Richard Rivera Ortiz saves the score for the Red Flash. A few drives later, the Red Flash would force another turnover, this time a fumble. The miscues really bedeviling the Blue Devils. We see here James Mallory will break a long touchdown run, or so it would seem. This would have made the game 7 to nothing, but a flag on the field would call the play back, and the Blue Devils would again be denied as Scott Lewis and Russell Fisher bring quarterback Aubrey Norris to the ground. The Red Flash trying to make up some ground on their own now. Antoine Rivera takes this pass near the outside, cuts it back in the middle, and gets absolutely lit up, but he hops right back up. A few plays later, Kyle Harbridge carries this ball down near the goal line, which would set up this Josh Thiel field goal attempt. The ball hits the left upright about as squarely as one could hit it without going through. And now, finally, the Blue Devils would break through. Aubrey Norris to Hoseway Paul, a 46-yard touchdown, makes the score 7 to nothing. The Blue Devils got a little greedy, though. Less than a minute to go now in the first quarter. Aubrey Norris back to pass, and he's going to get hit by Matt Parker. And Russell Fisher, the senior defensive lineman, showing some speed we haven't seen before. 51 yards for the score. He gets all the way down to the end zone on his first career defensive touchdown. And now the Red Flash have tied the score going into halftime. Third quarter now, John Kelly back in the pocket looking for Antoine Rivera, throws across the middle and finds him for the long gain. However, same drive, Kelly back again looking for the end zone. This time he's going to be picked off by the safety and the red flash would be denied in a scoreless third quarter. Fourth quarter now, Antoine Rivera on the bubble screen. Check out the big block by Jude Yearwood and John Kelly springing Rivera for a few extra yards later. On that same drive, Kyle Harbridge with the handoff, 31 yards out. Carrying not one, not two, three, four Blue Devils defenders into the end zone to give the Red Flash the score. However, a bobbled snap on the extra point would make the score just 13 to seven. The Blue Devils would respond. They would drive down the field and then the handoff to Eric Richardson for the touchdown. The extra point is up and it's good. And just like that, the Blue Devils hold the slim 14 to 13 lead. A minute and a half to go, fourth and eight. John Kelly back in the pocket. He throws that pass across the middle is incomplete and the Blue Devils would go into victory formation. They would take a knee. Your final score, the Blue Devils 14, the Red Flash 13 on Senior Day. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.